The sun came out, so I had a burst of productivity. Gonna test out some new LECA. Step one, be able to open the LECA. Step two, admire. This LECA is completely smooth. Use a side-by-side -side to compare against traditional LECA. This is where we get creative. I dump the LECA into a laundry bag and I'm using a pressure washer. LECA is really dirty and it should never be rinsed indoors because the clay can clog your drains. My LECA brings all the kids to the yard. Oh my god, did I age myself with that reference? Once the water runs clear, soak it for 24 hours. I decided to transfer a couple of alocasias that are in soil into the LECA. I'm just sick of dealing with fungus nets. Electricians don't come at me for using a soldering iron to make your initials. Now let's unpot these. And lo and behold, I found a surprise. There were totally two plants in here. I love when that happens. When transferring soil plants to LECA, it's really important you get every single piece of dirt off, otherwise it can rot. I've been testing out using a mycorrhizae inoculant. It promotes successful transplanting. And moving from soil to LECA is a huge transition, so I need all the help I can get. Just sprinkle like salt bay and you're good to go. LECA has zero nutrients, so I bank up a nutrient solution to fill up the reservoir. Looks so cute, and two weeks later, I already have new growth. And then I dropped the whole cup. <laughs>